the Franklin Fueling Systems Pump Selection Guide, available as a downloadable PDF or printed brochure, is to be utilized when recommending the Effie Petro branded submersible turbine pumps for use in typical service station configurations. The pump selection guide also includes reference material related to choosing variable speed, biofuel compatibility and advanced protection. The purpose of the guide is to help you determine the right pump for your application by reviewing the key system factors in five simple steps. Let's look at each of those five steps in detail. Step 1. The first step is to find the system layout that best represents the dispenser count, nominal pipework diameter and the piping configuration of your service station application. The pipe configuration can either be a single series pipe run or two parallel pipe runs from the turbine sump to the connected dispensers. For this example, let's take a closer look at a four dispenser, one and three quarter inch series piping configuration. When selecting the system layout, first consider the number of dispensers. Make sure to consider only the number of dispensers connected to the pump being recommended, not necessarily the total number of dispensers. Next, consider the nominal pipework diameter and the pipe configuration. Please note that if you cannot find a system layout that represents your application, you can always contact FFS Technical Support for pump selection assistance. Step 2. Ensure that the system characteristics of this layout conforms with your service station application. Most service station applications will conform within the listed range for tank berry depth, tank diameter, line leak detection methodology, and have conventional dispensing, i.e. non-vapor, recovery hanging hardware and dispenser. In this example, pump performance was derived using a minimum number of pipework fittings with APT branded XP175 or UPP 50mm pipework and with a nominal diameter of 1 and 3 quarter inch. A pipe run distance from turbine sump to first dispenser of 50 to 100 feet and a pipe run distance between dispensers of 20 to 35 feet. We can now review the pump recommendation. Step 3. We can now determine if our highlighted pump recommendation represents the desired flow rate with the number of nozzles operating simultaneously. Based upon the system layout and characteristics selected, we can now present the pump recommendation as follows. With a total number of 8 nozzles in this example, peak fueling operation will typically be with the 6 nozzles operating simultaneously and with 10 GPN per nozzle, which highlights that optimal flow in this service station application is being achieved with a variable speed 2 HP submersible turbine pump. With this, pump flow rates are estimated to never be less than 8 GPM, as indicated by the light blue shading, and never exceed 10 GPM, as indicated by the yellow shading, or exceed 10 GPM with manifold discharge pressures up to 46 PSI, as indicated by the red shading. Step 4. To determine if our recommendation matches your application, you will find an explanation of why we have highlighted one pump model versus the other pump models. Step 5. If our pump recommendation matches your application, you will find the basic model numbers available. With a basic model of variable speed 2HP confirmed in Step 4, Step 5 allows us to select the right model number option for this service station application. We further define the model number in Step 4 as base, biofuel compatible, or advanced protection. In closing, the Pump Selection Guide is a tool for recommending FE Petro branded submersible turbine pumps in typical service station applications. For non-typical submersible pump system applications, please contact technical support for assistance in recommending a pump for your application. For additional information, please visit franklinfueling.com or contact Franklin Fueling Systems.